Galaxy 7, we are deep within Rocket Town, and all these people tell me that I should go and check out the captain. In fact, this guy tells me that a rusted rocket uh, is all that remains of the Shinra space program. That wasn't quite what I was expecting. Look at him. What's he going to say? This just It just looms there. That's how this town got its name, Shinra number 26. You want to look at the rocket with me? Yeah, yeah, I, I would like to look at the rocket with you. Let's, let's take a look at this magnificence of technology. Do you reckon it runs on materia? Are those materia boosters there? I, I mean, how are we going to know? How are we ever going to know? I get so impressed every time I look at it. Sorry to get you into this. For me, it's kind of a hobby. But out of, but out of appreciation, let me give you this. Oh, I got a, I got a thing. I wish you'd take care of it and use it. Well, I mean, like, depending on what type of thing it is... I well, really wasn't expecting that. Uh, let, let's come all the way down to the bottom. It's a sword! Oh, it's a sword for me! Also, at the same time, we've got a power source. I'm going to give that to uh, to Barrett there. I'm also going to give Barrett some hyper. Hyper! Because I feel like he need. I feel like he needs it. That that noise was great. What what was this? Rune Blade, Yokoshari... Y Yoshi... Sh Yoshi... Yuki? Maybe? I don't know. It looks powerful, but man, sword is used when an ally is down. What does that mean? What does what does that mean? But it's only got two slots. I'm not sure if I want that. I'm not sure. I mean, like, this rune slot, rune blade's got four. I'm, I'm going to go with the magic. I'm going to go with the magic. Um, yeah, no, that, that, that's pretty much all we wanted to do here. I was like, do I want to sort anything else out? No, no, it turns out I don't. I just want to come up here and have a look at this thing. Look at its magnificence. Just look at it. That that is cray. It's um, whilst it is big, it's not quite as big as you expect for a, for a rocket. I suppose the the planet's smaller. I, I suppose that's a thing. Maybe this is like a Kerbal shell, uh, Kerbal scale rocket. You know, one tenth. Maybe, maybe it's got Shinra written on the side though, so that's pretty cool. Hey, what's going on up here? We're just gonna go check out the rocket, right? I mean, why why would you not? Hello. Look at this little wavy walkway. That's that's a bit weird. That's a bit weird. Hey, who are you? You look like a weirdo. Do you want to talk to me? Do you not want to... Hey, hey, I've been talking to you. What are you guys doing here? Uh, we heard the captain was here. Ha 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 ha! I am the captain. <laughs> My name's Sid. I, I kind of want to call him Captain Sid, but we'll just call him Sid for now. Uh, the name's Sid. Everyone calls me Captain No. What do you want? Um, it, ooh, um mm, tell me about the rocket. Wow, not bad for a kid. Oh, uh, well, cheers. All right, then. I'll explain to you. You know, the Shinra developed a lot of technology, technological gal gadgets during the Meaningless War, right? Meaningless War? Meaningless? Who are we fighting? I've never figured that out, really. Now it's a Mako company, but in the old days, it was a weapons manufacturer. Well, they came up with the rocket engine. There was so much excitement about the thought of going into outer space, our dreams got bigger and bigger. They put a major budget into it and made a prototype after prototype. Finally, they completed Shinra number 26. They chose the best pilot in Shinra. No, the world. Me. I mean, come on, who, who wouldn't? You know what I'm saying? And finally, when we got into the day of the launch, everything was going so well. But because of that dumbass Shira, the launch got messed up, and that's why what's the hip, uh, yeah, that's why they became so anal. So Shin, Shinra nixed their outer space exploration plans. Man, this this text box just seems a little bit big for me to read. After that, they told me how the future was space exploration, and they got got my hopes up. They got my hopes up. Ah. Then it was all over once they found out the Mako Energy was profitable. They didn't even so much as look at space. Money, moolah, De Niro. My dream was just a financial number for. It's true, for most companies, you know. Look at this rusted rocket. I was supposed to be the first man into space with this. Every day, it tilts a little bit more. At this rate, I don't know which will be first, which will be the first thing to fall over. Me? Oh, oh, which, eh, oh, I am I am on top form for my dialogue reading today. Let's try and get this uh, get this little little exchange down. My last hope is to talk to the president. There we go, we've managed it. Absolutely nailed it. Okay, cool. Can I talk to you again? My last hope is to talk to you. Can I go through here? No, no, we can't. Door there. There's a door, button, doors. No. I d okay, well, that that was informative. The guy wanted to go to space, um, but, you know, it wasn't profitable. I mean, it, it's pretty much the same story as every other space program ever, right? Also, have you noticed how I don't cast a shadow where that where the ladder casts a shadow? That That's really... That's breaking my immersion, man. I don't know if I can deal with it. I just don't know if I can deal with it. Uh, I want to try going this way. I don't, I don't know if this is a thing. I just want to see if there's anything around it. Look at this. We got, a, we got a thing. 
We got a thing. Where is it going to take me? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it just takes me back here. Okay. That, that's kind of fine. Hi, how are you? Everyone in this town was a mechanic back when they were planning to launch the rocket. That's nice. You, does that mean you can all work on stuff? Does that really mean you can all work on it? Hey, how's it going there? Hmm, let's see. Do I know any good jokes? Do I know any good jokes? Well, do you know any good jokes? I mean, honestly, do you know any good jokes? We've already been here. This was, I don't think this was the building I meant to run into. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think this probably was the one that I was meant to run into. Let's, let's try it again, shall we? Yo, what's up? Excuse me, Cloud? Uh, yo, what's up? You remember my name? Do you remember my name? Did the captain say anything? Uh, well, not really. Told us the rocket money. Oh. Well, you know, rocket money. <laughs> Shara, what are you, blind? We got some guests. Make some tea. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me make the tea. Excuse me, coming through. Oh, I'm on my way. Got to get to the sink because that's where you make tea at the sink. Really, uh, honestly, don't. I don't need tea. I mean, I do. If I could have another cup of tea, that'd be great. Shut up. Sit down when you're in, sit down in those chairs and drink your goddamn tea. Well, Sid's like all in the mouth, isn't he? Ah, oh, damn, I'm pissed. Shira, I'll be in the backyard t turning up, tuning up the <laughs> the tiny Bronco. Wait, we wanted that. And make sure to serve them some tea. All right, all right, all right. Can I can I um just say please? I don't uh, no. Okay, all right, that was fine. Damn man, what's up with that guy's attitude? I mean, honestly, what is it? Sorry, this is totally our fault. No, no, he's he's always like this. Well, why would you? Is he like this all the time, biting your head off like that? I mean, I, I would couldn't put up with it. No, it's because of my stupid mistake. I was the one who destroyed his dream. I mean, what what actually happened? It's story time, kids. Let's get down and do some talking. This is not the day. Hey, get your ass in the gear. You work like a snail. Even the moon will get tired waiting around for your ass. Yo, Captain, shut up. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry, sir. Don't take so much time checking that oxygen tank. Shira, be careful. Uh, being careful is good, but no matter how many times you check that oxygen tank, it won't matter. That thing won't broke even if hell froze over. But, 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 but. No buts! Uh, uh, top of my leg. They're not stupid, so be more efficient. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, we're going. Captain, our dreams are finally coming true. We're supposed to we'll be so proud to be a part of the launch of Sinra 26. Captain, preparations are complete. All that's left is liftoff. <laughs> yes, leave it to me. I will be back in a few. Well, you know, a few hours, something like that. All right, Captain, fly our dreams into outer space. Thanks, guys. We're praying for your safety. Okay, cool. This is nice. Instrument panel all clear. Shinra 26 ready for launch. It's got two seats, despite only ever being planning to take one up. But okay, there we go. Engine pressure rising. Shinra 26, three minutes to launch. Begin countdown. Finally. What the? What's happened? Sid, we have an emergency situation. A mechanic is still in the engine se section of the rocket. What? Who the? What? I don't know. Activating the intercom to the engine section. What's going on down now? What are we doing? It's Shira, Captain. Don't mind me. Go ahead with the launch. What are you still doing down there? I was still concerned. The results of the oxygen tank test weren't satisfactory. You stupid little... It's going to get so hot in there that there ain't going to be left when we blast off. You're going to burn to a crisp. You're going to die. You know that, don't you? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> if I could just fix the launch... Uh, if I could just fix this, the launch will be a success. I'm, I'm almost done. Don't worry about me. It'll be good. It's fine. Fine. Almost done? You're going to die. Sid. We must start the countdown. We won't make it if we don't. Starting engine. Hey, wait a minute. Shira's still in there. What are you going to do, Sid? If we cancel now, it'll be another six months until the next launch. Where is he going that needs six, launch six months until launch? Gosh dang it, Shira. You want to make me, mur make me a murderer? Uh, Captain. Shira. Tank number seven check is complete. Once I complete tank number eight, all is clear. Come on, Shira. Hurry up. You're going to die. 30 seconds until ignition. Beginning countdown. Sid, forget about her. We won't make it in time. Oh, it's slow text time. What? 
What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? We're going to watch the seconds count down because that's the only thing that can be done. 15 seconds until ignition. Internal temperature is rising. Like, honestly, I would have burnt her. I, like, I just got on with it. Oh, man, the moon. Out of space, my dreams. For that reason. For that very reason. I'd just be like, look, you can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs. Ignition. Engine ignition. Shoot. No, we fly! I literally would have just left her. No? No. What's with that little spin as well? I never noticed that before. That spin's a bit weird. Yeah, you fall over. You would have thought it would have, like, completely got... You see how the tip of the rocket is well past that sort of point of balance there? I, I would have expected it to fall. I really would have. It um, must be held up and supported by some weird, weird stuff there. He pushed the emergency engine shutdown switch, aborting the mission to save my life. After that, the space program was cut back and the launch was cancelled. It's my fault his dream was destroyed. Wait, wait, wait. All the workers are still in town and they still want it all to work, right? None of the fuel's gone. Well, like 30 seconds worth of fuel has gone. They can scrounge up some more fuel, right? All the mechanics are in town. Rocket's still there. I don't know, I'm just thinking out loud, guys, you know. That's why it's alright. I don't care what the captain says. I'll live my life for him. That's a bit creepy. That is a bit creepy. Ah, sure, I still haven't served him tea. Uh, I'm sorry. I was telling a story. <laughs> it's all about telling stories. Hurry up and sit down, or ain't my hospitality good enough for you? Man, I don't think I like Sid. I've, I've changed my mind. They're late. Where is Rufus? Oh, it's Palmer. Hey, hey, long time no see. So, Sid, how'd you been, buddy? Well, if it ain't the little fat man, Palmer, how long will you got to figure on keeping me waiting? Yep. So, when's the space program going to start up again? Hey, hey, I don't know. The president's outside, so why don't you ask him? Good for nothing, fat. Don't say fat. Uh, you shouldn't, you know. Hey, some tea. Can I have some tea with lots of sugar and honey? And yeah, don't forget the back the yak lard. The yak lard's very important. Um, I don't know if I want to go that way, guys. Like, President Rufus is out there. Hey, hey, have we met before? I, I don't think we have. Is the tea ready? Um, yeah, lard. Lard is... Oh, I didn't... I pushed the other direction. What the? You got me all excited for nothing? Then what you come here for? I want to borrow the tiny bronco. Yes. President Rufus. Oh. We're going after Sephiroth, but it seems like we've been going in the wrong direction. But now we think we know where he's headed. But that, w but we all have to cross the ocean. That's why we want your plane. <laughs> First the airship, then the rocket, and now the tiny Bronco. Shimmer took out a space from me, and now you want to take the sky away from me too? Oh my! You seem to forget it was because of Shinra Inc. that you were able to fly in the first place. Yeah, I'd agree with him. Um, excuse me. Uh, this way, please. Okay, alright. Let, let's do a thing, shall we? Did she just lock the door? You wanted to use the tiny Bronco, right? I did, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. I believe Palmer's going to take it. But why don't you talk to him? Okay, Palmer! Let's let's do this, man. Let's do this. I'm still, like, kitted out fighting the trine, aren't we? Uh, the material uh, monster or whatever it's called. Hmm, why do I have to do this? I'm head of the space program. <laughs> Snarf. Let's have a look. We'll be taking the tiny Bronco, thank you. Cloud, Cloud's drive. Nell. I've seen you somewhere before. I know, the Shinra building, where the president was killed. Oh, is this a security? I like, I like Palmer's voice. It's good. Oh, look, we're, we're all good. See, this is why I slept in the inn. This is why I slept in the inn. Uh, let's start... No! Let's start with a sense. Uh, and then let's summon it for it. Um, I, I don't know what else we can do here. Palmer, level 38. Let's get all this information down. HP 6,000. No no weaknesses, no pluses, nothing like that. Um, let, let's go for a Titan, shall we? I believe Cloud has got Odin as well. I should probably try and make use of that. Um, got, got to try and get all those. Oh, I didn't put the gold bangles on that I bought in this place. How how rubbish is that? Well, I have to remember to try and do an equipment run. That was, uh, so, 16 of those and we're good, right? That That's what I'm seeing. 16 of those and we're good. Uh, do I need to... No, I don't need to worry about making sure people don't die. Not not quite yet. Oh, I should have bioed him. He, he's, a, he's a human. He's like a normal biological being. We should bio him until he's poisoned. 
All right? That that's that's a thing that needs to happen. I, I definitely think that is a thing. Watch the plane, bro. What was that, man? Seriously, what was that? Diamond dust. Yeah, Barrett gonna summon Rama. Rama? Is it Rama? Is that how you pronounce it? I think that's how you pronounce it. It's taken me a long time to get there. Uh, you know, I've been playing this game since, like, it came out in 97, and I still don't know how to pronounce all these things. It's amazing how you just kind of, like, take in a word shape without actually processing how it's said. Or at least I do. I don't know if you guys out there do the same sort of thing. Especially with names, um, like proper nouns, if you will. Hick, he he hick, hick, what? Is he, is he just farting at us? Did, did he just wave his bottom at me? I'm, I'm not sure I agree with that. I'm not sure I agree with that at all. Uh, that's that's a bit rude, you know. First we've had potty mouths, and now we've got this guy showing me my butt, bu showing me his bum. I just, I feel disgusted, disgruntled, and other dis words. Uh, okay, let's let's get this going. How come the tiny bronco isn't also like included in the in the zapping? It's a question, right? It is a question. How do these guys know how to be so pinpoint accurate? I suppose they are sort of demigod type characters, right? I mean, Shiva. You don't get much more. Divine than Shiva. I suppose is the way to word it. Bam! Look, even the ice goes through the tiny Bronco. He, sh he should be dead by now. He should be dead. Okay, let's see what... Oh, bio, here we go. Bam! Any poison? No poison yet. That's that's kind of sad. Uh, I thought he had Odin. Okay, let's do a Quake 2. Barrett has reached his limit break. Who, who's, who's carrying Odin? It must be Cloud. Must be Cloud. Do you reckon this guy... Uh, can do a stop. That, that's the question. Let's let's do Odin. Ba -bam -bam. Okay, limit break, grenade blow. Let's do it. We're gonna get gonna get in between uh, these two summons here with the limit break. That's, that's just the way limits work, you know. The moment the moment you bust one out, you're away, you know. <coughs> oh, excuse me, a little bit of a throat clear there. Good. Get this going down. Grenade bomb! I've just noticed how much magic, uh, how much MP Cloud's got compared to everybody else. It's a, uh, that's a lot, man. That's uh, a lot. We're we gonna chock a mog. I think we're gonna chock a mog. I'm, I'm wondering whether I need to do a cure at any point. I've got to say, Palmer, quite an easy fight as things go. I'm just like laying out the punishment while he stands there dancing at me. I mean, I do, I do enjoy it when people dance for me. I mean, look at that. That, uh, that little side to side wiggle is pretty, pretty cool. The horse is amazing. Six-legged steed of championship. Um, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. And down it comes. Bam! Lance of Path. That was 1,700 points. Wow. That was that was more than I was expecting. A lot more. Yeah, you, you do a little dance. Do a little dance. Yeah. Love it. Love it. <laughs> Low. Are you going to get hit by the blades or what? Don't, 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 no, 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 me. Oh, he's running away. He's running. <laughs> where, where did that come from? Where did that come from? All right, well, there we go. Battle done, right? Yes, battle, battle is indeed done. That seemed, to say that seemed easy is a little bit of an understatement, I've got to say. I've got to say. End, Endicott. Endicott. Let's, uh, let's menu it up if we can. I can't menu it up. No, it's taken off. Forget it, get in! Go on, Barrett, jump, man, jump! <laughs> He's just kind of floating with it. That's, that's weird. Okay, let's let's go, guys. Let's go! Woo! Tiny Bronco, away! Man, my player models are just so sharp compared to the to the uh, to the plane. There, it's ridiculous. All right, Cloud, time to get into the. Oh, which way am I going? This way. I can left and right to try and get into it, it turns out. That, that's a thing. My name is Barrett! Nope, no, no, that's a soldier doing it. Come on, Sid, jump in, buddy! Jump in! Okay, where are we? Oh! Oh, we've been hit! We've been hit! We're going down! We're over the water! Ah, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try and get into this. Tail's been hit! Okay, can I, can I climb? Can I do some stuff? Emergency landing! Okay, that is, I can. I mean, this is gonna be a big splash. Hold to, hold on to your drawers and don't wee in them. Wee! I said don't wee in them. <laughs> woo! That's better. <laughs> we won't take wee, but we'll take a woo. Oh, <laughs> well, that went well. I mean, you can't do much better than like crashing a plane into the ocean, right? I, I've heard that's good. She won't be able to fly anymore. <sighs> can we use it as a boat? I mean, look, we are floating. Do whatever you want, man. Uh, Sid, what will you do now, buddy? 
Don't call me buddy, I just met yesterday. No, no, no. I'm history with the Shinra, and I've given up on that town. But uh, how about your wife, Shira? Wife? My wife? <laughs> She's not my wife. Don't make me laugh. Just thinking about marrying her gives me the chill. I I'd marry her. She seemed all right. What are you guys going to do? I don't know. Fight Sephiroth. We'll have to get Rufus someday. You know, save the planet. I don't know about any of that, but... What the hell? Sign me up. What? what? Hey, what? Are we can let this guy... In? Like, seriously, all he's done since he's shown up is swear at us and then, like, ran away from Shinra? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't mind. Oh, okay. What about you, Barrett? Glad to be aboard, Nom Scott. Seriously, you got to work... Like, watch the way you talk to us. Yeah, anyone stupid enough to go up against Shinra nowadays has got to be a Nom Scott. I like it. Uh, so, where are we headed? Rufus is going after Sephiroth to the Temple of the Ancients. Woo! Really? Where is that? Where is the Temple of the Ancients? Dunno. That numbskull skid was telling me uh, he was headed in the wrong direction, so maybe it's off this way. Pointing. Let's just head for land and get some information. The Temple of the Ancients? That name bothers me. Bothers me as well, you know. How to fly the tiny Bronco? Told we can't fly. Press the OK button to get in and the council to get on. That's OK. The tiny Bronco can cross shallow waters and rivers. Players can get on and off at the beach. OK, cool. Ooh, uh, let's spin around. I appear to be... Can we go, can we go through this way? OK, that, that was the thing. I was looking at my map and I was like, oh, look, this is a, uh, a, a, a little lake that I found myself in. But uh, it is not. Which way are we going to go? I actually, in all honesty, have no idea. I'm just kind of flying around like that right now. We could go to... Look, there's the, there's the buggy. There's the buggy. We Can I go up here? Can I go up I can go up here. Ooh. Now, which one? Was it this one? Oh, I can't go up the rapids. Look, there's a thing up there. We're, we're, that's not where I wanted to go, though. That that was just... Um, can, I, can I get out here? Is this a beach? Does this count as a beach? Does this count as a beach? No, not this side. I don't know if you guys remember that when I came out of calm, not there, no. Uh, maybe it's a little bit further. I can't go that way. Ah, there was a cave entrance, but I don't think I can make it that way. But we have tested out the 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 capabilities of the tiny Bronco. We get to walk in and out and stuff like that. And I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. I will see you next time when we're going to figure out where it is we want to go with the tiny Bronco. I literally have no idea. Um, if you guys let want to want to give me an idea, let me know in the comments. But I will see you then where we're going to do that. Bye! Bye!